Good afternoon. Just wanted to update everyone with the uh, with regards to the water quality in my fish tank. Uh, a few days ago, I had very green water uh, due to a good amount of algae buildup. I installed a small sand filter, and it looks to be like uh, everything's come together. The water seems to be crystal clear. Let me just move the aeration out of the way. You can see now how clear this water is in just 24 hours. So far so good. I didn't think the sand filter would clear up this quickly. Uh, there still is a little bit of buildup of uh, algae and stuff on the bottom of the tank and on the sides of the tank. But I'm going to leave that there for the fish to uh, to munch on if they're hungry. Um, uh, all right, I'll take you into the greenhouse now. Here's the uh, sand filter that I installed uh, about 24 hours ago. As you can see, the uh, inlet comes from the swirl filter, which I will be changing at a later date into uh, a different sort of filter. I'll explain that in another video. But the water comes in from the fish tank, down this 90 into the swirl filter, and all the solids uh, settle at the bottom. Clean water rises to the top and comes through that 90, down through here into the sand filter. As you can see in the sand filter, I filled it about one third up. Uh, it's about a two gallon container, one third full of sand. I put uh, three holes in near the top of the container and put some uh, scrubby pads using as a basic filtration as well, just to keep the sand out of the sump tank. But it uh, seems to be working quite well. Uh, good filtration through the sand and the water is coming up crystal clear. Here's our deep water culture system. So far so good. System's only been in place for, uh, well, I don't know, maybe a week or something like that. Uh, I did uh, have the other lettuce at the end down there in a previous uh, temporary system. But uh, so far, since I've installed, the lettuce is coming up really, really fantastic. Uh, these heads have almost doubled in uh, maybe a week, I think maybe nine days, they've doubled in size. Yeah, you can see nice, rich, dark colors coming through. Some of the outer leaves did have a bit of uh, iron problems uh, when they were first planted in the temporary system, but that has been uh, rectified now. So far, so good. Uh, down in here, I am going to try to plant some uh, some lettuce and some spinach here. Uh, going to do direct seeding. Going to see how that works. I'm not too sure if that's the best way to do it. Because right now, uh, my general practice is to do the seedlings. And then uh, once they're in seedlings and able to move, then I would put them in here. But I wanted to do a small test to see if direct planting is going to work for them. Here you can see some younger heads that are just coming along. I'll show you a nice little view. We are on a rooftop here in Malta, but this is uh, this is my view of where we are. Beautiful day in Malta. Temperature outside is about 15 degrees, but you can see in the sun in the greenhouse here, I'm reading uh, almost 30 degrees Celsius. Another beautiful day. If you like this video, please subscribe. And any questions you have, I'd be happy to answer. Um, uh, talk to you then, and have a great day.